Guys, what's up? So today we're sharing to get 3D Touch on older devices that does not have 3D Touch. So right now I'm the iPhone SE, and I want you guys how to get 3D Touch. So basically, this, as you guys know, the iPhone SE does not have 3D Touch, and older devices that does not have 3D Touch, I wish you guys how to get that. So this works on iOS 11, and this works on the iOS 12 jailbreak. Um, this I want to let you guys know this. This tweak does say it's, it says it's not, it does not support the iOS 12. It's not compatible with it, but it does work, guys. So you can see that this device right here is iOS 12. I'm going to search, and that that search right there tells you it's iOS 12 because it was sitting on iOS 12. It's just a weird search, so it's like different from 11 and below Cydia. So that's how you know it's iOS 12. And right there, guys, version 12.1. So that's how you know it's the right one. Okay, so once you open up Cydia, all you want to do is just go to your sources. I will have the source down below. I also have it on the screen. The source you want to add is this one right here. It's the um, repo.package.com dash. So once you guys add that source to add it, you just go to top right edit and then top left add and you want to add what you guys see. So it already has the HTTP semicolon dash dash in for you. So all you want to do is add the repo.package.com um, dash. It's like that. So once you add that source, you guys can go to search on the bottom or you can just tap on the source itself and then go to all packages and then you can search for peekaboo. So if you go to search, you can search for peekaboo or if you open the source guy did, you then go to the P section. All right, so we're in the P section, and then we can scroll low down, and there it is right there, Peekaboo. So then you can tap on it, and then yes, you can install it. Like I said, it says this package is not compatible with your device. It's not compatible with iOS 12, but it really is. It just says that because it hasn't been updated since March of 2018. But it does work. I mean, I'm on iOS 12 right now. So you just want to go to um, top right, and so it should say install for you, and you want to install a tweak, and your device will respring. Once your device resprings, you want to upset it. Once you're up settings, you want to scroll all the way down to your tweak section. So once you're down to your tweak section, you then will see a new tweak called Peekaboo. So you want to tap on it. And for me, I had my, it's originally on four sensitivity on one. So you do have to play around with this tweak to get the um, 3, 3D touch to work. So you first want to make sure that all your applications, it's enabled, which automatically it is. So you should be fine with that. And basically any changes you make, you just want to tap on respring. It's going to respring and then your device will come back on and the changes should take effect and you want to make sure it's enabled which all everything should be fine the only thing i changed was the force sensitivity because there's on one um originally and then it doesn't really work with one because when you hold down like a little because basically the higher sensitivity the higher the more force you're gonna put down so basically what's on one like you just hold down a little and then it basically um would delete your app as you can see the three touch is working because i can put a little more force on it but like originally like i can't delete the app now that's that's what i'm trying to say see like i'm just like barely even holding on to it that but I gotta go back to settings. I gotta change this and then I gotta tap on you know respring and then it's gonna come back and I could respring it. But the higher for me, it works the more it works. So I gotta so got tap on it, hold on to it, and you gotta play around with it first. So, like, sometimes like it does not work, and then you gotta keep playing around with it. And then, if you actually like have your finger down here and then push it down a little like that, it always works. But for me, it's just always working right now. Really cool. I mean, this is really amazing that you get 3D touch on you know over devices this is one thing i love about jailbreaking you customize the device and even if you don't have the newest iphone it's like i want 3d touch no you don't have to get the newest iphone you can just keep the iphone you have and just you know you get, get all the new features which i think that's how apple should do it but they don't it's like everything worked with 3d touch and it's just amazing it's just a little annoying like i don't know how i can delete the app unless i change the setting oh my god i see somehow <laughs> got to delete it it's just you gotta keep messing around with it Uh, 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 there we go oh my god like like barely even touched the screen hey guys thank you so much for watching i'll catch you guys in that's one like comment subscribe and peace